right, so it's time to explore Madagascar. I really love this level. Beautiful colors, spacious. And I mean, look at that game. It's eight years old. The details on the mud. Look at that. <laughs> right, let's do it. Got something some ruins here. up ahead. Wait here, I'll go take a look. Yeah, wait no, here, I old do. man. Still do a lot of traveling these days. Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hard condo now. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Read on. I have to do that in a chat room talking to some guy named Antiquity Master 37. <laughs> I can see that. Oh, there is something. How can I get there? Ah, hello. Oh, that's a treasure. to see here. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. <laughs> hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest 4x4. Four four. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. What's that? Would you look at that? A secret cave behind a waterfall. Gentlemen, we are on a pirate adventure. What are you, seven? <laughs> so, Victor, how is it that you know King's Bay so well, huh? Well, first time I landed for a swap. Going back. You went to Again, of course. And in the process of negotiating the bribe, we, uh, and I made it faster to visit a few years. Now maybe we can preempt any trouble we might get into. So we have to look for, oh, mistake. It wasn't like that if you want to. We it's just a note. the world in similar ways. Besides, she moved to Brazil. It's been a few years since we've seen each other. Well, maybe time for a visit. Maybe. First, let's wrap this up. That's it. Note. 
Well, I guess so. Let's get a move on. All right, let's get moving. A little warning next time. Guess the first time in years I've had two showers in one day. Oh, a bridge. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. I guess that's where we're going. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. That's a good thing having a four wheeler. Okay, that kid. Doesn't look stable. Don't drop us. I just keep it slow, keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on right now. It's gonna be fine. Uh, what do you suppose the weight limit on this bridge is? Well, I'm creaking. I say we're pretty. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Shit. Onward and upward. Ah, we're getting nowhere fast. You need traction here. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. <laughs> uh. I got mud in my mouth. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Uh huh. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Lemurs. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. I'll bet we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch. All right, hang on tight. Oh, gee. Shit. <laughs> hey, take this slow, kid. Yeah. Oh, boy. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, two, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because why exactly who knows maybe for protection british authorities were closing in on him sure maybe uh he helped them disappear i mean the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things oh boy look at that Okay, that wasn't so bad. Spine. <coughs> what about this? And go. And no. That was a valiant effort. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. Pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. 
They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. <laughs> oh boy. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour. Some big plans for this winch. There, that ought to do it. Well, that looked like fun. Steeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine. You've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha, <laughs> poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor. Patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Well, it's still taking a long time. What is that? Let's have a look around. You see something? Yeah. Oh. Ah, okay. Treasure. Anything else? Ah, okay, just a detour for treasure. All right, let's go. Would you look at that? Oh, oh. shit! Stop! Stop! They're here. I see them. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. And that means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead.
Okay, let's go around. What guns do I have? That's it. <sighs> Still can't believe this game is so awesome. <clears throat> Yep, mark them. Really want to sneak up on that one. Hang on. Over here. I get two grenades. Cool, cool, cool. Where is he? Shit. 
Thank you. Nate, come on, man. <gasps> Shit. Where is he? Okay, I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. What is that? Okay, I know what it is. I don't want it. Right, let's go, guys. Where's the jeep? <laughs> oh, very synchronized. <laughs> Oh. 
Oops. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Wait a minute. What was that? Aha. Gotta be enough. Come on, come on. <laughs> Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch, I was against getting ripped off. inside nope no turn into it <laughs> Sully just how well do you know Nadine why I was thinking maybe you can contact her convince her to call off her goons <laughs> yeah right what if we promise her a bigger cut than rate No, that's not how she operates she's more of a money up front kind of mercenary the rape's got the advantage there. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Stinging the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam. If you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> uh, hey, you think that old building's worth checking out? Ah, hell. Can't jump that high. Maybe we can move it in. Uh, maybe use the car. Just a suggestion. Okay, barrels. Now the shoreline knows that you're here. Sam, you were saying? No, that's right, I was. Uh, anyway, <laughs> history, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates, just in case, you know. Sure. Well, you know, besides books, push ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, <laughs> shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. 
He was in. Whoa! Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. All right. What were you talking about again? Uh, yeah. So, he was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go between. What was he like? Soft spoken, but intense. Like you could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? I got my money and got the hell out of there. Take a picture of me. Bro. There's a goddamn picture. Get out of the way. Wait. Okay. <gasps> Grenade. I want this. He was that close. Come on, man. See what's in there. <clears throat> well, I guess we can move again. But there's Wait a minute. It doesn't lead anywhere. Looks like we need to turn around. So, pirate walks into a bar. Okay, here we go. And he's got the steering wheel sticking out of his crotch. All right. So the bartender goes, hey, man, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says back, argh, it's driving me nuts. <laughs> ah, I love that one. Don't make me leave you out here. Nice view, though. Check it out, boys. What is it? <laughs> Maybe there is something. probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley.
Hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Oh, that well, would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Hey, what do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. But you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Such as pirate treasure? Maybe. Huh. Shoreline must have been here before. Finders keepers. 